Mr. Fursoff, why do I love Japan? Why do I love Japan? Mr. Fursoff. My dear friends, I've been in Japan, and I think this is Wonderland. And you may say, why it is Wonderland? Why in Japan you feel like Alice and the Rabbit in Wonderland? <laughs> and I will tell you why. Actually, Japan, this is the place where West and East meet together, married and male. <laughs> and do you know anecdote about Japanese, Ukrainian and Russian in technological Olympic Games? <laughs> and what was the result? Actually, Japanese they were far away, and they were far away forever. And you know when they catch them up. And actually, Japanese, they are proud about it. They are proud about their golden medal. And Russian and Ukrainian, they are proud about bronze medals. Well, but Japanese, we say, we are masters of technology. And why? Because you sell something to America, we will buy from the United States, Develop it, create, and sell it everywhere, and you will buy it for a good price. <laughs> well, and what else? Actually, you know, Japan, this is highly developed, technological, and computerized country. You may say, there's only machines, humanoid robots are there. Well, that's true, but there are a lot of intelligent people there. If you speak English, you will not be lost in Japan, because even old lady, in, in the region, will show you where, where it is. But if you ask old lady in village, okay, you are not lucky because you need to know Japanese. But if you say "Watashi wa Nihongo ga seki," that's okay. <laughs> well, it means I like Japanese, and you will be lucky, and you will get right away. <laughs> but what else? Actually, I enjoy that people so polite, and I enjoy their hospitality. We will we'll be invited to a restaurant, definitely. And in, in a restaurant you will understand that Japanese enjoy food. Food is enjoyment in Japan. But remember, that's not obsession about food. Obsession is in China. Because in China people eat everything. Sparrows, worms, caterpillars, crickets. But in Japan people like delicious food. Wonderful food. Extravagantly and delicately prepared. So this food should be carefully served. But some people, they mistakenly believe that sushi is only food in Japan. You are wrong. People think that breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks between sushi are consumed by people all day long. But this is the same mistaken stereotype like people think Americans, they eat hot dogs and hamburgers for all meals. <laughs> you are wrong. But if you come to a restaurant, people will tell you, well, we will give you raw fish, and this is raw fish with rice will be sushi, and just raw fish with sashimi, but we will not give you golden fish. It's in aquarium, it's for enjoyment. You'll say, yes, I know you. But we will give you raw chicken and raw liver of chicken with vinegar. Yes, I was afraid about it. I was afraid about chicken flu. Well, but we said, don't worry. Don't worry. You will not die. Oh, yes, it was a very good answer. I ate it and I alive. But next round they said, oh, Would you try fugu fish? I said, Yes, I was courageous like samurai. I ate it, but my blood became frozen. <laughs> well, and my body slept for 10 minutes. Well, but later I wake, woke up and I was lucky. Because if you are not lucky, you are dead. <laughs> But what else you can find in Japan? In Japan, you, I enjoy very much Japanese nature because nature around animals, birds, plants, insects, but all around. And Japanese people enjoy it very much. They appreciate four seasons all together. You know, Japanese people say spring, and Japan it means sakura. Sakura. Cherry blossom celebration, Hanami, wonderful tradition of picnic under sakura. That's your next vacation of a whole country altogether. Celebration of cherry blossom. 
And what else? For instance, even in Japan, only in Japan, you might find golden fish in a river. Just once I've been near a river, and what I found, one fishing man, he got with fishing stick a net golden fish. He took it off, but later he took it off and released <laughs> in a river. Big size, this size, golden fish. And maybe this golden fish is still waiting for you there in Japan. And is it really Wonderland or not? I think it is. And I think this my speech is a real acknowledgement of great culture, history, and tradition of Japan. Nippon, Yamato, Nihon. And some people say, welcome to Japan. One minute.